What is solid waste? Solid waste refers to any unwanted or discarded materials that are not liquid or gas. It includes a wide range of materials such as paper, plastic, metal, glass, and organic waste like food and yard waste. Solid waste is generated from households, businesses, industries, and construction sites. The amount of solid waste generated is increasing at an alarming rate due to rapid urbanization, increasing population, and changing lifestyle patterns. According to the World Bank, the world generates 2.01 billion tons of municipal solid waste annually, and this is expected to increase to 3.40 billion tons by 2050. The increasing amount of solid waste poses a significant threat to the environment and public health. Why is solid waste management important? The improper disposal of solid waste can have several environmental and health impacts. It can pollute the air, water, and soil, leading to environmental degradation, and cause severe health problems like respiratory diseases, cancer, and birth defects. It can also harm wildlife and aquatic life, disrupting the ecological balance. Proper management of solid waste is, therefore, essential to protect the environment and public health. Improper disposal of waste can also lead to the emission of greenhouse gases like methane and carbon dioxide, contributing to climate change. Landfills, for example, are a significant source of methane emissions. Methane is a potent greenhouse gas that is 28 times more potent than carbon dioxide in terms of its warming potential. Solid Waste Management Strategies There are several strategies for managing solid waste, including Reduce, Reuse, Recycle this is the most effective strategy for managing solid waste. By reducing the amount of waste we generate, reusing materials, and recycling materials, we can significantly reduce the amount of waste that ends up in landfills. Reducing waste can be achieved by making conscious choices like buying products with less packaging or buying in bulk, reducing food waste by planning meals and using leftovers, and reducing the use of single-use products like plastic bags, straws, and water bottles. Reusing materials can be done by repairing and repurposing items instead of throwing them away. For example, old clothes can be donated or turned into cleaning rags, and glass jars can be used for storage. Recycling materials involves turning waste into new products. Recycling reduces the amount of waste that goes to landfills, conserves natural resources, and reduces greenhouse gas emissions. Materials that can be recycled include paper, cardboard, plastics, metal, and glass. Landfills Landfills are the most common method of solid waste disposal. They are designed to safely contain and isolate waste from the environment. However, landfills have several negative impacts, including the release of methane, leachate production, and groundwater contamination. Proper landfill design and management can reduce these negative impacts. Incineration. This method involves burning solid waste to generate energy. However, it can also release harmful pollutants into the air. Incineration can be an effective way of reducing the amount of waste that goes to landfills, but it's not a sustainable solution as it does not address the root cause of waste generation. Composting. Composting is the process of decomposing organic waste to produce compost, which is used as a soil conditioner. It's an effective way of managing organic waste, reducing the amount of waste that goes to landfills, and producing a valuable product. Composting can be done on a small or large scale, and it's a sustainable solution to managing organic waste. Waste to Energy This method involves converting waste into energy, such as electricity or heat. It's a sustainable way of managing waste and can reduce greenhouse gas emissions. However, it requires advanced technology and infrastructure, and there are concerns about the environmental impacts of waste-to-energy plants. Conclusion In conclusion, solid waste management is an important issue that affects the environment and public health. The increasing amount of solid waste generated globally calls for effective management strategies that reduce waste, reuse materials, and recycle materials. As individuals, we can make conscious choices to reduce our waste generation, such as using reusable products, composting organic waste, and recycling materials. We can also support policies and initiatives that promote sustainable waste management, such as waste reduction programs and investments in sustainable infrastructure. As a society, we need to prioritize sustainable waste management to protect the environment and public health. 
Governments and businesses should invest in sustainable waste management infrastructure and support innovative solutions that reduce waste, reuse materials, and recycle materials. We must all work together to create a more sustainable future.